core thing that is at the center of Facebook is people and their social networks. Mm -hmm. And their social networks are a great indicator of a lot of other things. For example, what might you like to what might you like to do tonight? Mm -hmm. Your social network can really help you with that. What movie might you like to see? Your social network can have what what might you like to buy? Your social network can help you figure that out. That's right. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So it's the social network really at the center of the of the the information puzzle. Yeah, and it's everything from the simplest things. Just last night, I posted a status update asking my friends for recommendations about mm -hmm. travel agents, mm -hmm. and got seven responses before I woke up in the morning. Right. So this right. tends to be the kind of thing that if you ask a search engine, who should mm -hmm. I use as a travel agent, you're going to get a bunch of spammy results. It's a lot, mm -hmm. There's a lot of commercial interest around mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. And having a bunch of voices that you don't know screaming at you um, yeah. with, with ads and with other things on a site yeah. that doesn't know who you are isn't nearly as powerful as just mm -hmm. checking with your friends. Right. Yeah, and it's a fundamental part of who we are, and that's why it's so important. Is it, it really who we interact with, the things that we like, the things that we uh, uh, spend our time doing, those are fundamental parts of who we are, and by understanding that, we're better able to provide relevant results mm -hmm. to you. We've really seen that the most important signal in almost any analysis we do is the way people are interconnected. And those interconnections are something that are a, a, a truly unique part of uh, the, the data that Facebook has, mm -hmm. and it enables us to do some things that are really, really powerful. When you type in um, and are trying to do a people search on uh, a, a normal web search engine mm -hmm. that doesn't know who you are, uh, those searches, if you search for John Smith, it's going to have no idea which John Smith you're talking about. And it's going to mm -hmm. apply sort of a global sense of yeah. which John Smiths are most important in the world. Mm -hmm. Well, if you happen to go to elementary school with a John Smith and a bunch of your friends are already friends with that John Smith, mm -hmm. at Facebook, the first John Smith that's going to show up as we autocomplete is the John Smith that you know. Right. It's, it's almost eerily good yeah. um, how accurate mm -hmm. you can mm -hmm. get with just leveraging uh, the, the kinds of signals that we uniquely have. Right. So, so what you're saying is that our interconnection with other people is a really powerful way of figuring out what we might want or what we or what's relevant to us.